Welcome to this course on Mata Civil for Beginners. Based on my previous industry and life project experience, I personally believe Mata Civil is one of the best regional license program. This course was specifically started so that engineers can have a first-hand experience and appreciate the real benefits of Mata Civil. Alongside understanding engineering fundamentals involved in bridge structural analysis. Let us have a quick overview of the course content and structure. With this slide, I will establish the course objectives. This course, as the name suggests, is great for new users and beginners. Are you looking to get started with any bridge in analysis software? Or for a guided training to better understand the basic features and functionalities of Mata Civil? This course is for you. Through our intuitive, interactive tutorial and guided video lectures, you will get a good grasp on Mata Civil. Add it to get a beginner certification, take the quiz and submit the task for assessment. On scoring a minimum of 80%, you will be a Midas Academy certified. My name is Sindhu and I'll be your instructor for the next two weeks in completing this online course. I have a bachelor's degree in civil engineering and have been associated with MIDAS for past five years as software application engineer. To complete this course, we require a time commitment of approximately eight hours in total, including the task for assessment. The contents for beginner course is so organized to get yourself acquainted with graphic user interface of the software and easy to model techniques. We would be covering little of engineering concept here. However, this course is essential and would prove useful for you to proceed to next level of courses, that is the intermediate and the proficient levels, where engineering concepts in bridge structure analysis would be dealt with. The first session has two lessons where we will begin with a brief introduction to the software followed by software installation, license requirements, etc. The second session, Mastering Software, Mata Civil, will take you through a GUI of the software. It consists of six lessons. The first lesson would introduce you to the Windows and Menu systems. Then we will talk about the unit and then other preference settings. Next lesson is on different models of modes of viewing, that is manipulating the model views namely solid view, asymmetric view, etc. would be covered. Selection and activation is dealt in the next lessons. These operations would be extensively used, so it is recommended to get yourself fully acquainted with the said operations. Lesson 5, we would go through basic functions required to create a model, like creating a node, an element, translating and manipulating functions. Lesson 6 is also important as with any input needs to be verified for correctness in order to eliminate human error. All the sessions number two, three, four and five will be using interactive tutorials. These interactive tutorials have a established workflow. You will simply have to click through, listen and understand the instruction in the step to master the matter Section three, has just a single lesson, a quick tutorial on 2D portal frame to reinforce what we learned in the previous session. Coming to session four is again interactive of nature. We'll concentrate on post-processing features in Mata Civil. Each lesson would take you through defining different types of loads, again verifying these entries, running analysis of a completed model and various control options that need to be set. Once analysis is complete, it is also important to understand the types of results and their representation. And finally, we will also see what all ways these outputs can be produced or present. Session five is again a quick tutorial on understanding the results of a 2D portal frame we did previously in session three. The above five sessions would now prepare you to follow the instructions through video lecture. So I will meet you again in this session six, where I would give you a demo on how to model, define various types of loads specific to bridges, namely 
priestess loads, moving loads, etc. And then we will analyze the simple model, which is a superstructure of a single span PSE box girder, and get various structural analysis results. The final task is certification. After you are done with the video lecture, it is time for you to follow a PDF tutorial based on video and model the box girder bridge yourself. Submit the model files alongside completing some Q&A based on the model file generated for assessment.